Mary. I can't think about it. That fucking... Well, if he... If I find him... I swear, I swear I will... Tear him apart if I wanted to. And they still don't know how that bastard is still alive. No? <laughs> you. He's. Governments say things about they will freaking clean fix this damn town. <laughs> but they don't know, do they? No. <laughs> they just don't give a shit. They don't care about us. Care about control. <laughs> this government. Give <laughs> fucking piece of shit.
Hey, I'm uh, Joseph. That's your family, isn't it? I'm, uh, I'm real sorry. No, it, it's fine. It's alright. I just tried my best to save them before the chaos came through. But now it's too late. David Keaton. 2014. Blew the hell out of that Coleman mine. What happened to him? So David, he died. A lot of people died because of him and his freak show brother, Jeff. And you? What happened to yours? Pretty personal for a first time conversation there, little dreamer. Well, it's all right, I, I don't mind. I lost many things in that damn fire. My nice big kitchen, my old black lab Seymour. And well, my wife Nadine. Those degenerates from Ferguson's asylum They took everything from me. Now if I want to see my wife, all I have to do is come to work. All this time, all these years, in this tragic tale, now the government tried to do everything they can to bring this town back up. You forget all of this, never happens. It's like they don't even care. The government? <laughs> what a bunch of yo-yos. Trying to erase this town's memory of the Keaton family. Like how Jeffrey Keaton just died already. And I'll forget about him very soon. <sighs> Belief's a funny thing, dreamer. Ask most people to look up and tell you what color the sky is. And well, they'll say blue. But get enough people to say it's purple? And like that, everyone's saying the sky is purple. Belief at its most potent can be absolutely beautiful. But if mistreated, misused, it can be absolutely horrifying. Well, look at us. Aren't we a bundle of good times? <laughs> I better get back to work. Um, I got a four o'clock coming in. Gluten allergy. I knew that shit was serious. <laughs> you take care, all right? Uh, thanks for letting me rant at you. Have a good day. You too, little dreamer. I'll see you around.
Probably my mat machinations. Well, since I, uh, managed to take this mask out of Hungry Sword House Kenzo, I heard that, you know, that man who just beat to death. Oh, 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 oh. Man, steal one of his. <laughs> I teach those kids a lesson because they never learn how to teach older seniors a lesson. Well, those little annoying bastards can't teach a senior anything, and I teach them a lesson. <laughs> okay, what should I go next for the next thing I can steal? I kick their asses. <laughs> uh. 
Oh, what no? Out of ammo? You just don't know how to fly a zombie?
Just want to say thank you very much, Brandon, for letting me have this cameo. Absolutely love your work, man. I know you love mine. Let's keep the love going.